Welcome back to our National Security Reviews. This episode will discuss the differences between the Green Berets and the Ranger Special Forces. Before we get started, be sure to click the subscribe button and notification bell to receive new videos. When talking about top-notch teams, two groups commonly mentioned are the Green Berets and the Rangers. Both are respected for their training, unique abilities, and success in carrying out missions in certain conditions. Despite their similarities, there are distinctions between the Green Berets and the Rangers. The Green Berets, officially known as the United States Army Special Forces, form a part of the U.S. Army. Their main focus is on warfare, which includes training and guiding forces in guerrilla warfare strategies. Green Berets excel in defense, counterterrorism, direct action, and special reconnaissance. They undergo demanding training, such as the Special Forces Qualification Course, which is known for its rigor and length. Often working in teams called Operational Detachment Alphas, Green Berets can operate deep within enemy territories for extended periods. In contrast, the Rangers serve as an infantry unit within the U.S. Army. Their primary role is action involving raids, ambushes, and seizing airfields to capture or eliminate high-value targets. Rangers are also skilled in air assault operations, making them proficient in deployment tactics. The Ranger Assessment and Selection Program screens aspiring Rangers before the Ranger School. A rigorous leadership course that challenges soldiers' physical and mental resilience in simulated combat scenarios. A notable difference between the Green Berets and the Rangers is their focus. Though both units can carry out action missions, the Green Berets specialize in warfare tactics and foster connections with local communities. They often collaborate with units providing training to help them safeguard their nations from internal and external threats. On the other hand, the Rangers are primarily responsible for conducting combat operations, such as raids and assaults, to support conventional military goals. Another distinction lies in their setup. The Green Berets operate within special forces groups, each dedicated to a region. These groups comprise of operational detachment alphas, each possessing skill sets and areas of expertise. In contrast, the Rangers are part of the 75th Ranger Regiment, which consists of three battalions specializing in action missions. In essence, while the Green Berets and the Rangers represent factions within the U.S. Army, they vary in roles, training methods, and organizational frameworks. The Green Berets are highly skilled in warfare and foreign internal defense, whereas the Rangers specialize in action and swift deployment missions. When working together, these two units contribute significantly to the United States military's strength, standing prepared to address threats with accuracy and efficiency. If you found this video of value, hit that subscribe button and be notified of more national security news and information. Thank you for watching.